Welcome to Renaissance English Tuition IELTS Guide. Look at this cue card. This cue card appeared in a recent IELTS speaking test. Prepare it well. There is no school all over the globe where history is not taught. My school was also not an exception. History became an integral part of our curriculum right from the primary stage. In stark contrast to other subjects, I was very weak in history because I could never remember the dates and years precisely. Owing to this, I got only pass marks in this subject. Soon the subject became my Achilles heel. Consequently, I began to ignore it. In every history test, I was rebuked by my teacher. There came no day when I was not thrown out of the history class. However, today, I realize that without having the understanding of our past, we cannot imagine a prosperous present and future. This epiphany occurred when I discovered that even the children of grade 4 have better knowledge of history than I. Thus, for making up my childhood deficiency in this field, I aspire to ameliorate my knowledge of the times gone by. I am particularly fascinated about the Indus Valley Civilization. As the starting point of my quest, I already know that it was an ancient civilization of the Indian subcontinent which thrived in close proximity to the river Indus, around 8,000 years ago. It is also known as Hadapan civilization because Hadapa was the first city to be discovered after the excavations. I want to learn more about it since the information I possess about it is very rudimentary. I only know that the people, during this age, were great builders. They constructed highly sophisticated marvels for their times. The double-story houses of that time stand in competition with modern architecture. The Great Bath, the granary of Mohenjo-daro, its brick-lined underground drainage system and the dockyard. Allure me to search more and more about it. I really wonder from where did they come to know about the hydraulic system and the use of burnt bricks in construction. Most importantly, there are some controversies concerning the decline of this civilization. Some experts pin down that this happened because the city had become overcrowded, Conversely, others assert that the decline of trade networks with Mesopotamia caused this. Still others argue that the city was brought to ruin by a nuclear war or invaders. Some natural calamity or epidemic can also not be ruled out, according to a few. Opinions are divided as archaeologists sometimes also point out the possibility that River Indus might have altered its course. All this makes me exceedingly inquisitive. Whenever I get time from my daily regimen, I browse the internet for garnering information on the separate aspects of this civilization. The chief source of information is Google. When Wikipedia starts boring me with its technical jargon, I resort to YouTube. Apart from the online resources, I would like to visit a local university called Vishweshwaran and Vishwabandhu Institute of Sanskrit and Indological Researches. It houses an archaeological museum where the excavated relics of the Indus Valley civilization have been preserved with utmost care. The remains include many copper and stone tools along with some sandstone sculptures and the fossil of some plants and animals of the said era. Besides these, the museum also contains a crown-bearing head structure of Lord Vishnu from the 10th century. The crown of the deity is believed to be adorned with flower garlands and a chakra. Also, an intricate stone Garuda and an idol of Lord Mahavira from the 9th century glorify the museum with their presence. Scores of erudite scholars from various parts of the world pay visits to this celebrated institute for India-related researches. Above all, the library of the university can provide me an access to the repertoire of the books on the same subject.
This is how I plan to embark on my studies of history in near future. That's all for today. You can add or omit some details according to your cue card and time limit. Thank you for watching the video. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit the bell icon for notifications. See the description to follow us.